Grant McNeil here, owner and founder of the 12th Fret Guitar Shop. The 12th Fret will be celebrating its 45th anniversary, June 1st, 2022. I'm here today to announce my planned retirement on that date. 45 years, it's hard to believe. <laughs> it's been a great adventure, countless wonderful memories, lots of great friends, and I have so many people to thank. My first business partner, Dan Charman, who sadly passed away in September, we opened the shop together in 77. Then Dan moved to Pender Island, BC in 1984. Pat Keenan was my first employee. Pat's been my webmaster and our right hand and my right hand man for decades. Early days, we had Mike Zimmerman, Gene Farr, Billy Arbor, Rob Libby, Rob Sager, Mark Caruana, the late, great Eric Paikala, Rod Phelan, Russ Lackey, Jerry Markman, great guitar player, Steve McPhee, Mike Cabaldew, Doug Cameron, George Rizzani, Alain Bouard, Tim Cameron, Tony Farr, and the late John Buzzy Birak, amp repairman extraordinaire, and master luthiers Gordon Berry, Jay Halati, Scott Shepard, Dave Hill, Doug Harrison, and the late Brian Miller. All had essential roles. The late Cam Roberts designed our computer software during the 80s and 90s. Without that, we could have never grown the company. Richard Smythe, John Tilden, and all the other talented guitar teachers, plus Ed Capella, who ran the music school all these years, I thank them all. Carla Hoyer, our bookkeeper, who for decades kept things running smoothly, and Helen Regler now fulfills that essential role. Chris Bennett and Brian Dickey, my best friends and brothers in arms, who have helped me so much along the way. Dave Wren, my business partner from 1990 for 18 years. Dave got our first generation website up and running in 1996. And sales staff Mike Gray, Evan Douglas, Jeremy Rose, plus Vicki Gray, our social media manager and online sales programmer. They've all done so much to keep things running during these difficult COVID times. And of course, Max Moy, my store manager and my right hand man. Well, over 50 individuals have made the 12th Fret what it is today. It's been a privilege to work with all of these wonderful people. And those in the industry who helped and mentored me in early days, Bill Longley at MES, Robert Godin, Fred Gretsch, the Gibson Kalamazoo factory, Dean Markley, Larry DiMarzio, Harold Rhodes, Fender Musical Instruments, Ron Valeriot at Guelph Music, and later on, Deering Banjo, National Resophonic Guitars, John Larrabee, Gary Richardson, Amrik Singh, and in Spain, Amalia Ramirez, and of course, Jordi Julia Andres at Alumbra Guitars. The list goes on and on. And finally, our customers. I'm grateful and honored that so many of you, over 40,000 individuals, have trusted your prized possessions to us to restore and to repair, and sought our advice to choose the next fine instrument to enjoy and make music with for generations to come. And thank you to those who relied on us, who trusted us to sell their vintage instruments, family heirlooms collected over a lifetime. They've now passed on to new custodians to enjoy. We were all so young when I opened the shop in 77, and we've grown older together. In these past 45 years, guitars and guitar making have enjoyed a true coming of age, an exciting time to own a guitar. Improved glues, finishes, wood seasoning, assembly processes, plus endless experimentation, vastly increased our understanding of what made these wonderful vintage instruments sound so great. And now luthiers can routinely reproduce these once mysterious characteristics. We see hundreds of amazing independent luthiers following their dreams and making a living wage building the finest instruments in history. So what does the future hold for the 12th fret guitar shop? Well, the 12th fret is unique in the world. There's nothing quite like it. It's well run by motivated and knowledgeable staff. 
We're blessed with a loyal clientele who are as passionate about guitars as we are. Frankly, I think the 12th fret will be just fine. The ideal person is, no doubt, waiting in the wings to assume ownership and carry on into the future. Sue and I look forward to seeing you all again when the 12th fret celebrates its 50th and 60th anniversaries. Thanks to you all, my friends. Grant McNeil.